Tim Brent, Chicago Apartments and Condos. Website is homes-condos.com. Today I'm in the Lincoln Park neighborhood in a two-bedroom, one-bath apartment on Sheffield near Dickens. This is the front door. A nice coat closet or entry closet. Nice stone entryway. Now in the main living room. See the gas fireplace over there. Exposed brick, which is very nice. This faces west, so it's going to have a really good light. Also faces the street. See really good hardwood floors. Ceiling fan. Recessed lighting. It's recently rehabbed, as you'll see as we go through it. Here's the smaller of the two bedrooms. Still a good sized bedroom. The closet goes the whole width of the bedroom. It's a smaller bedroom but it's nice and you can kind of get a feel for how high the ceilings are here looking above the doorway. From here we're going to walk across the hallway to the second bedroom which is much bigger. Again really nice hardwood floors, good moldings, high ceilings. Just like the other bedroom, the closet goes all the way across. It's going to have really nice closet space. Kind of get a feel here. You'd have plenty of room for a queen size bed. Maybe even a king. I'm not sure about that though. We continued through the apartment. <coughs> really nice new vintage bathroom. See the stone tile. Nice big tub. Tile goes all the way to the ceiling. Back in the dining room and kitchen area. Here's the dining room. Put a really good sized table in here. Back here is the back closet, which is really deep. So if you're looking place for your vacuum cleaner and stuff like that, I think this would be a very nice fit for you. Looking back across now at the kitchen. Kitchen has really nice cabinets, some glass fronts, large stainless steel refrigerator, over-the-counter microwave, <coughs> stone countertops, under count, counter double bowl, stainless steel sink, dishwasher, and again the exposed brick back here gives it a really nice feel, a really good look. Got some track lighting up there. This is a breakfast bar also, so if you wanted to go with a breakfast bar here and not do a dining room table, it would give you a really nice space for an office or an extra room. A really good feature of this is you have an in-unit washer and dryer. Behind the washer and dryer you have the furnace and the central air conditioning. It's gas forced heat. Again tile here below, so it's going to be easy to maintain, keep clean. And here we'll walk back out the front of the, to the front of the apartment. Bathrooms on the right, one bedroom on the left, one bedroom on the right, big wide hallway, and back out to the living room. <coughs> 